A South Diamond Head man who lost his waterfront home during Hurricane Katrina is determined never to lose another house to a wicked storm. He's among the first to build a all-concrete house in the area. Tonight, Hancock County reporter Al Shower shows us the unique structure and tells us why the builder says his concrete is the wave of the future. Mario Espinosa's South Diamond Head neighborhood was desecrated by Katrina. There were no homes left standing, but he says his new house will withstand a powerful storm like Katrina and even stronger ones. I think concrete is the answer. Uh, this product, uh, you ain't going to believe it, but uh, it doesn't burn, doesn't sag, doesn't rot. Terry much can I eat it. It's resistant to Category 5 hurricanes, tornadoes, and earthquakes. The contractor says it's the first of its kind in the entire state. All concrete from the bottom to the top. Even the roof of the house will be constructed out of the concrete-covered panels. There are some other products out there that have concrete block walls, foam concrete, but they all have wood trusses. Things that this house is totally concrete. Uh, the roof, the floors, everything is made with the panels. The panels are made of foam and metal wire at ICT, a company located in the Long Beach Industrial Park. They are assembled and covered with concrete on site. The contractor says the concrete panels can withstand 240 mile per hour winds and meets FEMA's F5 tornado strong room shelter standards. With our product, the entire house is considered a strong room. So you don't have to build a specific room, it's the entire structure. Building with this concrete technology will cost about 10 to 12 percent more than traditional wood construction. But the builder says in the end, it pays for itself. Then you get uh, 80 percent off your wind pool and then 80 percent off your homeowners. And that in itself has been a big, big problem with people building back on the coast. Rogers says the energy efficient product will also save the homeowner money. And he says those are just some of the benefits of using the concrete method. We you have a storm, you know, if you usually have to tear out sheetrock, you got to pull out insulation. Man, you go in there and pressure wash it, you move back in. In Diamond Head, Al Showers, WLOX News. And the three-story home is expected to be ready in about four to five months.